What's up everybody? Back at it for another vlog. I've just given up on guessing what number I'm at now. So today I got off work a bit early and we are heading to Shabandawan Lake. So let me break this down for you. There's this fly fishing or fishing lady named Rebecca Red and I was in contact with her last year about possibly filming some fishing and stuff like that to help grow with her channel. During I got to go fishing, so that was cool. But it all fell through. We uh, never got together, never did any filming. Kind of just let it go. A couple days ago, I got an email from her asking if I want to try again. So picture scheduled for today, but I have been unable to get a hold of her today. So she told me where to go to Shabandawan Lake, and now uh, we're just gonna. I'm gonna wing it. Don't really know where I'm going or what I'm doing. We'll see how this turns out. It's about an hour drive from Atacokan, so at the end of the day, if, uh, if I can't find her, doesn't work out or whatever, it's only an hour back home, so not too not too big of a deal. But uh, no adventure started with, uh, I'm, st I'm staying at home and sitting on the couch, so I guess uh, worst case, I get there, don't know where I'm going, can't find the place, can't find her, can't get a hold of her, and I turn around, come home, have dinner, and that's my night. Uh, I got a lot of editing to do, so wouldn't be terribly mad at it if I had to. Uh, about halfway there right now. Um, more I think about it, not too, getting not too confident. Not too confident in this working out, but uh, adventures, man. Adventures are where it's at. Uh, I hope you guys, you know, take this as a lesson and just take chances in life. Get out there, have fun. Don't sit around at home and take the no risk, really. What is the worst that happens? I just go home, right? Not a big deal. But what's the best thing that could happen is I have a freaking awesome time fishing, get some sick drone footage, and you know, it's just a great time. So to me, it's worth the risk. Let's see what happens. So everything worked out. We made it out here live. Uh, it turned out that Rebecca was actually at the camp. Uh, she didn't abandon me. Apparently phones don't work out here. Uh, so we're out at Shabandawan boat in the water and we are working our way towards where we're gonna fish do some more shooting uh, we did a bunch of shooting at the dock and uh, just trying to make a cool little video so we'll see what happens to break out the drone now uh, we got some really neat stuff using the DSLR um, I, uh, I took the drone up for a quick little flight there and it's pretty amazing probably some of the neatest stuff I've shot uh, I can't believe how much the fly line sticks out it's actually insane it looks so cool from above um, this is definitely some of the most unique footage I've shot and definitely some of the most unique footage I've seen uh, from a drone uh, it's, it's 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 crazy it's good stuff That's it folks, heading home now. Holy cow, was that a epic day. Epic, maybe not, epic's a little bit, I hate using that word too much, but what a friggin' awesome day that was. Rebecca is totally cool, uh, really glad I got to get together with her. Um, she's definitely an unreal fisher woman. Watching her fish is, uh, is like poetic, it's pretty crazy, she's good shit. Got the drone up, chased the boat home, the drone, that was really cool, and got a lot of really neat footage of her fly fishing. Shot a lot of good stuff, I hope, I think, on the DSLR that uh, I'm gonna whip together a little Instagram kinda video for her. But as always, thanks for watching. Uh, remember, get out there, get flying, and have fun. Take care, guys.